how to set up the iPhone 16 series for the first time. Now on the side here, there is a power button. This is the camera button here, and the button at the top is the power button. So press and hold on that side button for a few seconds. Once you see the Apple logo appear on the screen, you can let go of the button. Okay, so the phone is still booting up. Once you're on this screen, select a language of your choice, and then select your country. So tap on that, and then we will scroll down. It is now setting language. So I want to tap on that. Uh, when I tap on it, it will ask me to use that country. So instead, we need to scroll down and select a country. So here, I'm going to scroll all the way down. And then we choose United States. And it is setting the language for that country. Now tap on continued. And then tap on set up without another device. Here, you need to connect to your network. So I will select and connect to my Wi-Fi network. Put in the password and then tap on the join button. Wait for the network connection. This will activate your iPhone for the first time. Once it is connected and activated for the first time, your warranty will start. Okay, on the data and privacy screen, tap on the continue button. Then tap on set up for myself or set up for a child. And then here, say, so do you want to set up Face ID? I'll choose set up later. And here, put in a passcode that you would like to use. Otherwise, you can tap on passcode options. And in here, you can choose custom alpha numeric code, custom numeric code, four digit numeric code, or don't use passcode. Select one of the options. And in here, I will not use passcode. Next. Do you want to transfer any data over? If you have data to transfer over, you can choose to transfer from iCloud backup from another iPhone, from a Mac or computer or PC, or from an Android phone. I'm not going to transfer anything, so I would choose don't transfer anything. Next in here, you will have the opportunity to sign in to your Apple account. If you do have an Apple account, put in your account uh, ID. Otherwise, you can choose forgot password or don't have an account. In here, you can create a new Apple account or you can choose set up later in settings. I will choose set up later in settings. And here in terms and conditions, tap on agree at the top and then choose only download automatically or continued. I will choose only download automatically. And here you can set up iMessage and FaceTime. I will choose not now. And here you can choose to turn on location services or later. So tap on one of the two options. And then it says set up cellular. I will choose set up later in settings. Next, set up screen time. You can again, you can set up later in settings or continued. And then you can choose to share or don't share with Apple about your iPhone analytics. I will select don't share. Here we can select to use light mode, dark or auto. Select one of the options and then tap on continue. And then we need to set the silent mode or the action button on the side here. So tap on continue. And then here you can choose customize the action button. Otherwise we can use the default, which is uh, the silent mode. Now I'm going to select not now. And then tap on continue for camera control. So here click camera control to open camera app. Then click again to use camera control as shutter. And then tap on continue. For Siri, you can choose to set up Siri now, or you can do that later in settings. Then tap on continue. And finally, swipe up to go to your home screen. On the home screen, you will be able to access the camera, the phone app, the messages app, and any other apps that is built in. 
you can see some of the apps are still downloading and installing so by default uh, most of the apps are not installed so you need to download and install it now on the side button here you will notice there is a camera button press on it it will open up the camera app then press on it again will allow you to take a picture with the shutter button if you long press on it you'll be able to control certain features such as zooming so depending on which mode it is so here all you have to do is just touch and hold for a few seconds do not press it just touch and hold and then once a controller appears down here as a notch you'll be able to control it so here i will press i will touch and hold so it has a number of different functions such as single click or double click or if you touch on that once it sends that you are touching the buttons uh, some functions will appear allowing you to adjust such as zooming in or out so this is kind of a new features uh, we still need to uh, learn exactly how, how it works i think if you press on it gentle like half press do not press it all the way but if you half press then it will open up these features and then you can slide across the buttons to uh, zoom in or zoom out so you can see i can just slide it in and back and forth apart from zooming there are other features as well uh, such as uh, changing the style the tone the brightness and exposure and so on you just need to be uh, you need to set the button in the right uh, selected mode and then you can control it and that is the camera button right there that is a new uh, button new uh, features on the iphone 16 pro and that's it so that is how you can quickly set up your iphone 16 16 plus the pro and the, or the pro max thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos now if you need to configure uh, any apple account you can always go into settings to set up your apple account your iCloud id you can reconnect to another wi-fi network you can set up your cellular uh, card uh, sim uh, you can do a lot of things such as adding other accounts on your device you can set up Siri any step that we have uh, skipped during the setup process you can always go into settings to uh, uh, set up and here you can change the wallpaper you can set notifications or change your uh, ringtone sound so this is the reflection sound And that's it. Thank you for watching this, this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos.